What's going on guys? It's your boy Noah Pescatelli. Welcome to another video. Today, if you guys are wondering what's going on, it's like 6 o'clock right now. I'm about to leave. If you guys are wondering why I am cooking food over there, it is because, uh, one, that food would get bad if I didn't cook it. I would have to throw it out. That's a waste of money. Also, I do need some food for traveling today. That's the main basis of this vlog. I'm actually going home today. I'm done with school. Everything went amazing. You know, got my grades and I achieved my goals. I ended up getting a 4.0 and I, I just am so pumped about that because, you know, I worked my butt off for it. I really deserved that. And I put in the hours. I mean, like I said, I finished like eight projects in two days. I pretty much finished like two weeks worth of work in two days. So I was like working my butt off this quarter. So psyched about that and so happy and um, blessed I get to do that. So I'm um, going on with what I got right here. So as you guys can tell, I got my bag right there. Sunglasses, box I need to take home. Um, blender, some mail, keys, a little bit of money I need to grab. Over here, I do have some camera equipment. I have some big things coming soon. So I'm trying to bring in a decent bit of equipment. I got my uh, Canon XA30 right there. Got some shoes I want to take home. Backpack with my laptop in it. That's just a bunch of random uh, GoPro stuff mostly. Gimbal, just some batteries. Tried to tidy up the house and just get everything ready before I leave. There are the few meals for the car ride. Well, I just ended up eating one of these right now. I can't believe I ate that this early. I don't, oh, full. Okay, that's a lot of food, guys. I want you guys to understand that's a lot. Look, it might not look like that much. That's 900 calories right there. That's a lot of food. But yeah, I'm gonna clean up all this stuff right here. I'm gonna get this packed for the car ride. Clean that up. Clean all this up. We should be good to go. We should we should be great and get out of here because I don't need to be waiting too much longer. I wanted to, I woke up early because I wanted to get I wanted to hit decent time. <laughs> So guys, that is about it. I just packed up everything really quick because I was like, I just need to get out of here. I didn't really feel much. That is about it. I'm about to leave the house. You know, I've, I've been, I'm going to kind of miss it. You know, I've been here the past three months. Um, it's been good. You know, I've been able to focus. Uh, I've been by myself, you know, living by myself, as you guys know, for like the past couple of months. So, but it's been good. Got the boat behind me. We are ready to head back to Atlanta. But I do have to get gas first. Like next level Chevy. Motorsport, put that thing in sports. Shout it bad, pop a like a court. Pop it, you a dork. Never been a sport. First of all, I like to apologize if it's too loud right now, but I do want to talk about a little topic since I'm in the car, and I think this is a great opportunity for me to get some business stuff done. I do have a few phone calls today that I do need to get done, uh, a handful of phone calls I do need to get done today and just get a lot of work done and get just pound everything out. So there's one thing that a few of you guys have been asking about that I think is very important. I think it's a great question, especially for the youth and for people who are wanting to build their self and apply their self towards life to, to go kick ass every single day. There's one comment on my last video that I actually just posted yesterday. There's two comments where a few people have asked, how do you build a business in the fishing industry and make it successful? Well, the first thing that I've been doing this for five, five to six years now, and I've learned so much, it is ridiculous. And anything with business there's ups and downs and the first thing that you want to evaluate and figure out before you even hop into this whole business deal i can hop on that phone call later uh business the whole business side is the first thing you need to know is what are you going to love doing it that that is the first question you should ask yourself i know that you asked in the fishing industry but the first question you need to ask yourself is do you love what you're about to hop into. I mean, are you going to eat, sleep, breathe, eat? Like, are you going to do this? Are you willing to do this 
for 30 years? That's the first question because I don't believe in starting anything if you're not going to put in 150% and blow it up because there's no point of follow, uh, I mean, starting something and not following through. I think that's shitty. I don't, I don't ever think you should start something, work on it for a year, and then quit. I think that's stupid. And anyone who does that, I mean, they're not... They don't take... I don't want anyone to take what I'm saying and get offensive over it, but I don't believe in starting something and not finishing it because... That's, that's not the most successful way to do it because what most people don't understand is they've been working on this craft for three years and they only have a thousand followers but then again tomorrow they could wake up and have 30,000 because you never know when you're about to hit that point in life or a point in time with the business where it is about to blow up. So that's one thing. You're going to have to stay committed. You're going to have to know that you love what you're doing. That's the biggest thing. Hopping into this, I think this is amazing. Most of my fans and supporters or people who watch my videos by my demographics are from 18 years old to 35 years old. That, that is great. That means most of the people who watch my videos are around that age. And which is awesome because they can relate to me. Um, a lot of you guys who are asking this are a lot of younger kids. It just depends what you're looking to go about. I think it is awesome if you're like 15, 16, 17, wanting to do this right now. And if this is what you're wanting to do, I, I truly suggest that you go pound it at 150% and you go knock it out and do what you want to do with it because you're starting young and there, you, you can't beat that. That's what I did. I started young. I'm 19 years old right now. I started this when I was 14 years old. Like, and now I'm seeing where I'm at and I've got to build this empire. And of course it's filled with ups and downs and right now it's on the lower end. But all in all, just go ahead and start. Start with the business. If you want me to create a video on this, I don't want to take too much time in this vlog to dedicate towards this because this vlog is just about my life and what I'm doing today and I don't want to spend 10 minutes talking about this. But if you want to see a video more in depth on you know what I did to start kicking their bass TV or if you guys want some tips on what I think smart in the fishing industry right now then go ahead and smash the like button let me know below and I'll go ahead and get that to you motorsport yeah. put that thing in sports shot it bad pop a like a court pop it you a dork never been a sport pull up here in gas station stop number two what's up people a little update just got back to Atlanta about to drop the truck or not the truck but about to drop the boat off right now just got a lot of stuff done got on a lot of phone calls on the ride back I still have a lot more I have to get done today um, I believe I have like three or more phone calls three more phone calls I need to get done that I promised I'd get done today because I've been so busy past two days you know were my lap were the days that I've actually had off pretty much of class and so these past two days I've just been kind of you know slouching around a little bit so today's the first day a pretty much I guess you would say break quote-unquote break but this is not gonna be a break this is gonna be you know the next two months of working my ass off that's what this is gonna be I'm not even gonna label it a break it's gonna be labeled working my ass off next two months um, so I'm gonna drop this off get this done hop on to the next thing I do need to go home and uh, do a few things and then I have some video plans I want to plan today because I need to, as you guys know tomorrow is Thanksgiving and I want to make a Thanksgiving video, which I'm going to be doing today. And uh, this video, I don't know when you guys are going to be watching this because my upload schedule might change. As you guys know, I usually upload Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Sundays. I might even do something where I'm uploading almost every single day. If you guys want to see that, smash that like button. Let me know because I'm ready to bust shit out this break. Glad to be home? Yeah. That's good. Well, you got a home, but I mean, this is... <laughs> I'm currently eating a meal right now and working on an Instagram photo. If you guys were wondering, I do all the graphics, you know, all the graphic design work for thumbnails all the way to Instagram posts, social media posts, um, all the way from my motivational posts to thumbnails for the videos. 
all that all that stuff. I feel like the value of content is really good. I enjoy making this stuff, and a lot of you guys enjoy seeing it. I don't get as many reactions, you know, like stuff on it, but in my opinion, I think it's very, very great content to post. All right, guys, so I finished up some stuff at the house, took a shower, and now I'm back on the road again. I have to stop by Extreme again because I need to pick up something for my dad. He actually sold something on Craigslist, so I'm picking this up. Heading to SS, which is my dad's other job. I'm going to be filming a video with all them there. I guess this is what he sold. It's a big sub box. I need to make room for that in my truck. How's everybody doing? What's going on guys? What's going on guys? What's going on guys? I'm actually at my dad's second business right now, um, SS. We just finished filming the Thanksgiving episode. You guys are watching this after the Thanksgiving episode. So if you guys haven't seen that, it's not like based 100% towards Thanksgiving. So be sure to go check it out. It should be titled, um, Thank You Family, I Love You. So go check out that video. I think it's really good videos for my whole family right here. Um, go check that one out. What's going on, dude? What's going on, brother? How you been? Uh, good. Busy, but good, man. Like always, I guess, right? Heck yeah, man. I'm about to... Today's the first day. I'm about to get stuff rolling, dude. I'm I'm, I'm pumped. <laughs> you got a little free time and you're excited about it. Oh, aren't you? dude. Well, I don't know about free time, but I got, I got business time. I'm excited. I'm just thinking... I'm going to start sending you a link or two. Yeah. I'm going to have to look at it, and hopefully I'll find some there what uh what the camera gear I want and like that I don't have it yet it's like super hard to like get all jacked up about going to film because yeah just finished up a few phone calls I still got two more that I need to take care of later tonight but this is a post I actually just made I don't know why I won't focus I know, it's not one of the focus perfect. If you guys haven't followed me on Instagram definitely go follow me you know I put a lot of time into these posts and I, I, it'd really, I'd really appreciate it if you guys go check them out. Like lately, I've seriously been putting a lot of time into these like Instagram posts, these high quality pictures, you know, editing them to the best possible, making great captions, um, great headlines on the post. And it just means a lot if you guys go check me out on Instagram at kicking underscore T H E I R underscore bass underscore TV. What's going on guys? It's actually Thanksgiving. I just like to say happy Thanksgiving. I know you guys are not seeing this on Thanksgiving, but I hope you all had a great Thanksgiving. I ended up dragging this vlog onto um, the next day just because I ended up, you know, going to the gym. Um, I went to the vitamin shop, I went to Walmart, got back home, edited a video. You know, I was just kind of hopping all over the place and ended up not vlogging all that. You know, I was just gonna put my head down and get shit done. That was just what I ended up doing. And I ended up not working too late. I usually can't, I mean, I usually have to work at least until, you know, 12 o'clock, 11, 12 o'clock. Like, it's just kind of like a habit, like 11 minimal. It's, just, it's a weird habit. And um, I stopped kind of early yesterday, but today what I'm about to go do, you know, I've had my dinner and everything, or lunch, Thanksgiving lunch already. I got like an hour of daylight, daylight, which sucks, and I just can't stand it because I really didn't get much done today. I actually went to the gym very early because they were open this morning, and I'm going to a local boat ramp because I do want to take some photos of my truck and also some of my new 13 fishing gear. I want to get some photos done because um, just some content on Instagram, and that will give me something to do tonight. I will be able to edit this vlog um, as well, so I'll be able to edit this vlog and also edit some photos and um, prep pretty much some content for all my social media platforms and Instagram. I think that'd be pretty cool. These next 30 days, guys, are gonna be absolutely amazing. I'm so pumped about it. I can, I, like, I'm so excited that I can like put the next 30 days all into my business. Wow, guys, this is the boat ramp I usually put in, and look at all these trees. We are good to go. I miss this lake right here, guys. A Lake Lanier that treated me dirty last time. I'm gonna come out in the next couple of days and I'm gonna go slay some fish because I got to redeem myself. I only had like one or two bad days on Lanier this year and one of them was the tournament, but that's, <laughs> that's just how it goes. I'm gonna take some cool photos here. Just got some sick shots, I'll play of them. Just got some sick shots, I'll play some of them right now. All right, guys, just got home. I'm going to edit a lot of stuff and finish everything up. But I hope you guys had a great Thanksgiving. 
Hope you spent time with your family like I actually did earlier. I know you guys are just seeing a little bit of today, but you know, I'm grinding the rest of the day out, gonna be working and doing my thing. But thank you guys so much for the support. If you guys enjoyed these types of vlogs where I'm just documenting my life, documenting what I do every single day, then smash the like button, smash it up, smash it up, smash it up, and comment below and also subscribe and hit the little bell. But thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so much. All the support that you guys show me, it truly means a lot to me. And uh, I couldn't thank you guys enough for helping me out. And the reason I'm where I'm at today is because of you guys. And I just couldn't be more thankful. But thank you guys so much. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Motorsport. Yeah. Put that thing in sports. Shout it back. Pop a like a court. Pop it. You a dork. Never